or that will send you a new one don't worry about that we're sorry that this happened to you this is the company that you want to spend your money on i tell you guys all the time that one of the things that you focus on is after sale customer service as you guys already know i have worked with inokim in the past you guys saw a couple of unboxing that i did i already have an inokim os of my own but the founder sent me this electric scooter when he sent it to me he was like i'm just sending you this we are appreciate what you do it's not for you to do uh, anything create content do whatever you want to do there's none of those oh you have to make 50 videos or anything like that none of that because of that if you guys see the way that this you know came is customized right now it was because when he did that i couldn't help but appreciate this company even more because they're willing to take a chance on some random guy that make videos and he say you know he really appreciate what i'm doing for the community because you guys have to understand the electric scooter community was slowly just dying off and unicycles was taking over but i know a bunch of guys who were riding electric scooters all of a sudden they switched to unicycles they switched to one wheel and they never went back to electric scooters anymore i was tempted to get on those unicycles and i'm like no i'm gonna stick to electric scooters there's, there's not a lot of people that are pushing it and i think he understood that that is why he was like i really appreciate what you're doing for the community to keep it up and when i got this uh you know came over so i was like i looked at the group like what what do they want most of them they want a newer version of you know him they want something brand new they want something different like what i do is i want to inspire people I don't just want to get products and then just make another video about unboxing the product and showing you what it can do yes it can ride fast blah 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 there are so many people who have unboxed the inokim oso so i said to myself what can i do what can i give back to this company what can i do to make this thing to make people be like damn you can do that with an inokim oso and that's when i started customizing this thing this customization pretty much cost me half of the money that you will pay for an inokim because i think just that deck alone for this this metal area that you're seeing right here that deck i paid at because i had to get like five pieces of them to cut them out and put them together it cost me about 300 bucks i'm not cheap man because i wanted this thing to come out really good the handlebars the there's a light that you guys are seeing that's see if i can see it it's a light that's going right there that you guys are seeing this is light i don't know if i can turn the thing on the power is on the other side but i think i've shown you guys this you know before you guys have seen me riding it this is a bunch of customization that i did and my goal was when i finished putting like customizing this thing and putting everything together that when people see this they're gonna be like whoa that's inokim i'm gonna i'm about to go buy my inokim and start customizing it and when i did that it set up a movement that a bunch of people who were slowly like thinking to themselves that oh there's nothing they can do to the inokim and i even went as far as to under here is a light setup that i did i set up the light multiple all this thing i did by hand and the carving and all that it took me days weeks to to do this because my goal was that when i put this thing out there it's gonna go viral people start understanding like yo this scooter is you can do so much with it and uh, the company give you so much room to customize and all that stuff because there's a lot of electric scooters that are out there that you can't really customize or add your own stuff and a lot of us want to add a little bit of our personalities to this uh mobile uh vehicle that we use to transport you want to add a little bit of you in there i wanted to show people that you can do so much with this thing and i added the light oh, okay had to power it on from over there hope you guys can see it I added the light that's on the deck to make it light up and all that stuff the design the hole and all that you can get a little bit closer so you guys can see what i'm talking about like i put in so much time to make sure that when i put this thing out there everybody's gonna be like whoa this looks crazy look at it right there it's the video that's right here this thing hit 1.2 million views that's it right there the mods everything came together it was crazy i had comments i had people like inboxing me like whoa what is going on is that an inno came and this is the founder even he was like whoa what did you do to that school 
scooter, man. But I had a bunch of people who had Eno came <laughs> who were asking like how much. But that was my goal because I think that this is not an electric scooter company that should stay in the background. This like this is one of the most trusted electric scooter that have been tested. Um, now of course no electric scooter is perfect. Don't get it twisted. But I think the main thing that a lot of people will have issue with will be the brakes. And I think hopefully they have gotten um, ahead of this thing because it's it's a it's a Zoom brake, but you know Kim branded. I don't know what it is with Zoom, but they always give issues to a lot of electric scooters. But most of this thing, when you get it out of the box, most the motor, everything, it just runs. Uh, you get it and you go. So I just want to put it out there. I hope that you know Kim is listening, and I hope that they are in the future able to give us some high performance stuff. Uh, super scooter. I know it's pretty much gonna be a super scooter at this point because we have waited a long time and i hope that they actually do that because that's that's a scooter you know i'm getting because even before i bought my hollybun gx i was asking them i'm like man are you guys coming out with something are you guys coming out with something because that was gonna be the next scooter that i buy if they were coming out with something like 72 volt that was gonna be the next thing that i buy but since i i figured that they were not gonna come out with anything that's why i was like you know what it is what it is but yeah man you kim is one of those companies that should be recognized that you should be paying attention to their main focus right now is mainly just making electric scooter accessible globally even though that's their main focus it's still an electric scooter company that you gotta be keeping an eye on because i understand that what they are capable of this electric scooter the you know so people have beat this thing uh people ride this thing in crazy places uh because this thing is international a lot of electric scooters that you have seen you 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 see them mainly in places with nice roads and all that stuff these things go through rough roads crazy roads and all that stuff and most of them get up to like five thousand miles before you even experience anything that's if you're not maintaining them but if you're maintaining them they will pretty much last all the way to uh ten thousand miles so these are really good uh electric scooters to build by a company that have like safety is their main goal and i hope <laughs> we hope we're like crossing our fingers and hoping that they will step into the high performance i know they can produce something that actually rivals the segway gt2 rivals the in motion rs i know they can do it one of the things that i've come to pre appreciate about the Inno Kim company i take time to watch these companies to see what they do when things go wrong there is no electric scooter that's out there that's perfect but what you want is when something does happen the company does not give you a run around they step right in front of it and handles the business they take the responsibility if it's their fault and take care of the issue i watched the inokim company before i even start talking about them because it is bad to brag about a company and they end up letting you down so i did my research i, I did a lot of observation of, about how they resolve issues and stuff and i saw them on multiple groups people were like oh you know my inno came this happened and then all of a sudden this broke off somebody messaged right there oh really we're sorry that this happened to you give us a message we'll send you a new one i was like what what company is doing that <laughs> you guys already know the issue that's going on with the nami right now people can't even get nami to uh, admit anything this company someone that i've had their scooter for a long time and i was like this broke and as i was riding somebody commented on the group that works for you kim oh i will send you a new one don't worry about that we're sorry that this happened to you this is the company that you want to spend your money on i tell you guys all the time that all this damn electric scooters that we're all riding most of the time they're all gonna be experiments one of the things that you focus on is after sell customer service because most of the time you're going to have to work on this thing yourself you're going to have to fix the electric scooter yourself and because of that you want to make sure that you get the best customer service possible there is no point for you to spend spend five thousand dollars on electric scooter and you can't even get a hold of anybody when things go wrong not even getting a hold of somebody when you get a hold of somebody they give you the run around like you did not just dish out that amount of money to pay for their products most of the inno came they are in the 2k world but they still provide customer service like these things are worth 10k this is why i come to appreciate this company and i'm giving you guys the real right now that's the experience i've had now if you have had different experience and stuff might be where you bought 
bought the electric scooter from because they, they don't have some distributors who most of the time they won't behave the way that you know the main Inokim brands behave but if you do buy direct from Inokim I'm telling you right now their customer service is as good as the one from Mini Models uh, that's that's just my my two cents in there if you guys are wondering you know why is Kizzy talking about this company like this because customer service is extremely important to me it's one of the most important stuff and I also want to make sure that when you guys do go to this company that you guys are taking care of if you're not hit me up <laughs> send me what they said because I want to make sure that I'm giving you guys the right info on that but most of the people that I've seen that are in some I joined all the Inokim groups just to watch and see how they deal with people deal with customers just for that anyway thank you guys for watching thank you guys for also supporting the channel and before you guys start asking the mods and this and that I think I have most of this mod in the link in the description you guys can go check them out i do um have my wife is the one that's doing all that stuff and any link that's not being used she takes them off so if you guys are not using those links there's no reason for all those lists to be up there they are gonna be taken off so you guys use the links to make your purchases so of course we'll do add more of the all the customization and all that stuff that most of you are probably looking for some of these things we take time to find them thank you guys for supporting the channel i really appreciate it every one of you this is kizzy you will here peace out